Check this out. We got a book. This book you've seen before. Okay. This book you've seen before. It's one of two books that I actively try to buy online. Grant from Colorado. Salute, salute. Hope you're doing well. This is one of the two books I try to buy online. Okay. It's on my watch list always. Do you know what it is? You've seen this book. Books are good indeed. Do you know what this book is? <laughs> it costs this book costs ten dollars. Shipping costs seventeen dollars, seventeen fifty. Prison Rune Books for me. Oh, Prison Rune Books are too bad, Colorado. Colorado is a crazy place. Boulder, Colorado is even crazy. One of the crazy, crazy places in Colorado. All right? Book costs ten dollars. Shipping costs seventeen fifty. So twenty seven fifty US. All right? And I have this book. I buy this book. I actively buy this book. We gave away a couple of copies of this book previously on our yearly Twitch auction. Giveaways. <laughs> nice. Ah, oh, kitty cats are gonna love this. Check this out. That's Sal. They love paper. Just tearing it apart. This, the Essential Psychedelic Guide by DM Turner. <laughs> they love paper. The Essential Psychedelic Guide by DM Turner. We read the Salvia Divinorum book, right? And twenty-seven fifty US is a good price for this book. It's not in great shape. That's actually not bad. It's in pretty good shape. Nice. Nice. We I think we read some of this. We read all of Salvadoran, the psychedelic essence of Salvia de Venorum, right? And I've read this book probably three times so far in my life. Right? Fantastic. It's about uh one of the greatest psychonauts there ever was, D.M. Turner, about his experiences with psychedelics and entheogens and different types of uh, experimenting with his consciousness, right? Experimenting with his consciousness. Boulder, yeah, but Cheryl says Boulder. 10 square miles surrounded by reality. Yeah, but it's a fun place, but it's a fun place. Awesome. You want to see the table of that table of contents on this? DMT is gone indeed. Ketamine took him out in a bathtub. Don't do ketamine in a bathtub. DM Turner. Here's the table of contents. We'll read some of it. Table of contents, right? Introduction. A brief, a brief history of psychedelics. Psychedelic safety. Traditional psychedelics. LSD, psilocybin mushrooms, mescaline peyote, and San Pedro cactus. And en, empathogens. En, en, empathogens. Ecstasy, 2CB. Uh, exotic highs of a connoisseur. DMT. Uh, harmala alkanoids ketamine multiple combinations further exploration dmt water spirit uh, psychedelic reality bibliography right and what he does in this this is before he wrote salvador on the psychedelic essence of salvia divinorum i'll link it up in the description of the video once i load this video up right and um he basically in this these are basically gives a little bit of history a little bit of his understanding explanation and he goes through and does different uh, chemical combinations experiments on himself and writes about his psychedelic uh, trip reports right wow 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 awesome deal 
total $27.50. Fantastic price for this book. Fantastic price. Ten dollars. The person put it up, and the shipping was seventeen fifty. I had no choice on that. Okay. Very happy to add another one to the collection. And at some point, we're going to read. Most likely, we might read the whole thing. It'll probably take us about four or five live streams to do it. It's a bigger book than uh, the Salvador and the Psychedelic Essence of Salvia Divinorum, right? Emersonic MDMA is my favorite. Always have such a good time with it. Cool, cool, cool. Oh God, mescaline is the only way to fly. <laughs> read some. You want me to read some? Let's let's read it on Rumble. Let's read it on Rumble. I agree. Elder God, we read it on Rumble. Okay. Read a passage. I'll read you guys a passage. Let's read a passage. We'll do as we did before. There is a hundred and nine pages what page should we read what page should we read <laughs> grant for colorado <laughs> just shows like chill yeah grant for colorado uh the best way to comment on our live streams you're new here look at the butterflies are chirping out flying around this butterfly is amazing right we have a butterfly plant here that uh, 69 <laughs> i should have guessed that attracts butterflies right so uh grant from colorado uh, just so you know if you're gonna comment one word comments it's okay but the odds are i'm gonna be skipping a lot of it right uh 420 I, it doesn't have a 420 <laughs> we'll go to 69 let's read 69 69 this is 69 Oop. the high okay this one oh look at this so it's part of this ketamine the ultimate psychedelic journey this is ketamine is what took him out the um turner right so it's intensity 10 infinity so he gives it a ranking starts at page 63 okay starts at page 63 he goes through you know the materials history dosage administra admi administration and stuff like this and just so you know as a tribute to DM Turner, I did my own write-up of a trip report that I did when I did a three-day master cleanse fa fast and broke the fast with sal uh, with salvia duinorum, psilocybin mushrooms, and cannabis. And I wrote that up and I structured it like this, right? Structured it like this. Okay, so let's go to page sixty-nine. Uh, by the way, oh, okay, yeah, what was his name? I forgot his name. Yeah, you should listen to our mods. They are great mods. I'm going to read just one paragraph, this paragraph, okay? Actually, I'm going to read the top two paragraphs. I have a kid can ever sonic sense. Yeah, he was hyper. He maybe maybe a little chill cigar and a little bit of reading might do him good. Okay. <laughs> Jen she says, mmm, kid cat. Con. Okay, let's read this. After about two years of once per week ketamine use, I even found that I had developed an addiction. Although it was less severe than what I've described above, it took considerable effort to break the cycle of repeated, repeatedly using it, even though I was aware of uh, detrimental effects that it was causing. Since that time, I've used ketamine only occasionally, but find that I must continually exercise a high degree of willpower to prevent myself from falling into a pattern of regular use amongst those i know who use ketamine i've seen very few who can use it in a balanced manner if they have access to it 
One of the most remarkable things I experienced in becoming aware and aware of and breaking my ketamine addiction was the intervention of the tryptamine drugs, psilocybin and NDMT. The DMT provided insights into the negative effects ketamine was having on my life. A reduction in ambition, a reduction in healthy moral fears, such as the fear of death, as well as the reluctance to confront fears or difficult tasks and situations directly. Frequent use of ketamine can lure one as an escape since it is since a blissful and fantastic state of fearless disembodied consciousness is so easily available okay i'm so glad we picked page 69 okay and read these two paragraphs keep in mind that dm turner a few short years later died when he was doing ketamine in the bathtub okay so his addiction unfortunately took control of him and cost him his life he was a psychonaut. Uh, he, I have, there's very few people that I have tremendous amount of respect for. Uh, DM Turner is one of them. Bill Hicks is another one. Terrence McKenna is another one. There's a few other people out there, right? Not because of what he did, right, to his life and stuff, but because he sacrificed, he, he, he explored his awareness to the maximum and unfortunately when pushing the limits sometimes uh, it costs you your life take the warnings that he shared to heart i did okay i did